Hey guys and girls, Matt from SamRolling.com, and today we're talking about mics in plain sight. This is because uh, I'll throw up one from uh, the Netflix Lost in Space uh, special, and uh, this picture kind of blew up uh, because the mic was in plain sight. It's actually used as basically a zipper, um, so it's with a hide mic solution, and I've done several videos on the hide mic um, solutions, although I still, that reminds me to do one on the bra mount, and that's what I need to do as well. And uh, figure out the t-shirt mount. Can't quite get my head around that. Um, yeah, so hiding in plain sight. Why is it a good idea? It's a good idea because it basically sounds better. Mics, uh, especially obviously radio mics, the instead of being buried, if they are outside and exposed, again, you can have it exposed like here and it won't sound very good, but you get the general idea around the chest area. Um, and then obviously, depending on your wind protection, that kind of thing, uh, you obviously need, bless you, you obviously need, um, like, yeah, wind protection, that kind of thing. But um, having them exposed, especially in indoor scenarios, is really, really useful. Um, a great example um, that, that anyone can pretty much do is if you get a massive, massive wide shot, and obviously people are on radios anyway, um, and you generally can't get the boom in, then what you can do is, for instance, if it's in a timeout, just poke that out so you can actually... Um, so when you're up close, you can see it. Uh, the trick is also not to freak everyone out, because as soon as you point out where there's a mic in plain sight, people will go, oh my god, everyone's going to be able to see it. Um, but that's just blatantly not true. Even with boom sometimes in shot, I've seen, <laughs> looking back over like episodes of Frasier and things like that, you see the boom, like sometimes just in shot. I don't know. It's just there. Um, or even people like an Alan Partridge. So um, They're always kind of fun to look out for, kind of IMDb trivia style. Um, so yeah, uh, hiding in plain sight, great massive yeah advantage to the actual sound quality of the mic. Um, and generally people use things like uh, Countryman B6s because the capsules are so, so tiny. Um, and now we're seeing more and more solutions like the DPA uh, buttonhole mounts where basically you're just pushing out a little hole and I'll uh, link up uh, to that video there as well, hopefully, if I remember. If I don't, I'll try and put it in the description or leave me a comment down below. Um, so yeah, I guess the main thing to say is that wide shots are really good. Obviously, any time as well, as long as it doesn't change the sound too much, uh, time mic's perfect example is if you have to have have to have it in the time mount. And let's say they've got like I don't know beard and a scratchy collar and it's it's not sounding great. Any time then there's off lines or the person is basically behind like this, you obviously can't see the tie. Just poke that little bad boy out there. Um, and see, see what you can get away with. Obviously with rehearsals, and making sure that people don't suddenly uh, whip pan round. Um, so yeah, hopefully that uh, gives you some ideas. Hi uh, hiding in plain sight is a brilliant thing. Try to keep it on the down low, and then uh, yeah, don't even tell anyone after, because then they'll get really annoyed at you. Um, and then you can uh, basically end up on the forums like they did with Lost in Space. So um, let me know what you think down below in the comments, and I will see you later.